What's up guys, my name is Sergeant Manley and welcome back to Rainbow Six Siege Lone Wolf. We're going to be doing some more Terrorist Hunt Classic. I've already done a couple of practice rounds. I have been recording all day and I am ready to, uh, to get in here and have some fun killing some terrorists. So that is exactly what we're going to do today. Now, you may have noticed this week that episodes are a little bit shorter. That's because I am trying out my 30 minute video idea. Um, honestly, I feel like it's a lot better in the long run. I, um, I don't have to focus so much on getting as much content. I don't have to record for, you know, I can record for 45 minutes, the length of my normal episode, and get an entire video out. And, uh, so far, I think it works pretty well. I haven't seen the analytics on it yet because I'm recording, once again, everything uh, at one time here, so I can take some time off to, uh, to, to, to take some personal time. So, uh, you guys will have to let me know what you thought about everything, uh, in the comments, because I really, really, really do want to know what you guys think. So, uh, without me rambling on anymore, let's get right in here and start to take down some terrorists. Let's see, I'm just doing a quick perimeter sweep to see what's going on in here. Uh, we have some C4 in this area, so I am going to avoid that like the plague. We have an entry point up here. Um, bu -bu -bu -bum -bum. Let's do my usual and send out a drone to check out the area for me. Okay, we've got some barbed wire right here. Uh, I've got a guy right behind the door, two guys right behind the door. I hear a breather somewhere in this area, so this may be a good way to go, but I'm more curious about the watchtower, so let's go check that out, shall we? Can I repel? That is one heck of a throw. Okay. So we're going to walk up to the roof and examine this for a second because I... Oh, look, a nice little garden. I don't really know where the best spot to make entry is. It's probably... Oh, there's a window. Um, sure. Let's put a breach charge up there. Breach charge over there. And uh, make it go boom. That should definitely draw. Oh ho ho ho! Oh ho ho! Oh no, that's not what I wanted. There's a breather right on the other side of the window. That is not what I wanted to happen. <laughs> oh man. Maybe I can shoot. A little bit and draw his attention over here. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. Op four eliminated all friendlies. Well, just like a dummy, <laughs> I fell off of the roof. <laughs> Alright, Terrorist Hunt Classic on the plane. The Commonwealth Royal Flight. We are here at the service entrance, I believe it is called. And uh, we're going to totally make entry and not die. Right? Pretty sure that's how this is going to work. We're going we're, we're gonna, to we're gonna make entry and uh, kill... Everyone. Oh, drone first, as always. And we immediately have one guy right there. Let's see if he has any buddies. It doesn't look like he does. Oh, buddy knows I'm here. Come on. There we go. By the way, I'm playing his IQ this time. 
uh, just because I know there's a lot of C4 on this map. And uh, in close quarters, you, you should... It's the best idea to know where the C4 is. So, I also... I don't have a suppressor on her weapon, but I do have a holographic sight. Oh! Hi! Uh, but I do have a holographic sight and a... Um, uh, a... Uh, compensator, I believe it's called. To, uh... To keep the recoil down when I rapid fire like that. So... Yeah, I didn't... I didn't really expect somebody to come up behind me, so that was a little bit of a surprise. Oh. Come on. You've got to poke your head out at some point. There you go. Somebody coming up the stairs. Oh wait, no, that was me. Okay, yeah, nobody coming up the stairs. Okay, so I think it is now a good time that we've taken out four enemies to uh, to enter the aircraft. So let's crouch down nice and slow. Actually, is my drone still back here? I doubt it. They seem to uh, disappear rather easily, but I feel like I'm safe now, so I'm going to send out another drone... Yeah, another drone to do some actual exploration because I didn't even get to come past uh, this point with the other one. Well, let's see if there's anybody in the cockpit. There normally isn't, but I'd rather be safe than sorry at this point. And it looks like the cockpit is clear. So let's go in here. I do hear some C4. Uh, if we go into the storage areas, there's one immediately down the ramp. So, we now know our next plan of action, and we will wing the rest of it, I suppose. Because uh, that's, uh, that's typically what I do. So, we still have one breather on the map. I think he might be very close. Closer than I would like for him to be. That is probably a true statement. Hello? Okay, I'm gonna go this way. Have fun. Oh, there was totally a guy here like five seconds ago. Oh, there's one down there. Definitely one right there. Okay, we've got one down. Let's peek around the corner. Oh! Goodbye. Goodbye. Oh, man. I knew. I had a feeling, anyway, I didn't know, but I had a feeling that he was definitely going to sneak up behind me. I also have a feeling that there are more enemies in here. That feeling was correct. I am not about to go down a ladder. No, thank you. That corner's clear. This corner is clear. Now that's clear. Oh my gosh. Okay. So both breathers on the map are down. Is that a breakable surface? I feel like it's probably not. No. Okay. Ooh, so both breathers on the map are down. Uh, this little service area is probably clear. Uh, but we're gonna go we're gonna go all the way back through just to make sure because I do not trust this game at all and I am not about to go down a ladder or through one of those or anything like that so
I hear footsteps. Here they come. What the heck? Told you. I told you, I don't trust this game at all. I don't trust this game at all. <laughs> hmm. Where are you? Okay. That actually did kind of scare me, but I know for sure that there is somebody in the room below that hatch. So, guess what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna blow the crap out of that hatch to distract them and make entry down below. I feel like that is a plan I can stick to. That actually worked. I didn't didn't really expect it to, and I have somebody approaching behind me. Or to the side of me. Somewhere. I do hear footsteps. I'm gonna go ahead and reload. That was actually a pretty good technique. I'll have to keep that in mind. Okay, so it is clear behind me, from what I can see, the kitchen is full of barbed wire, but luckily there's nothing in there that I need. Um, it is clear for at least that section. So, oh, and that section is barricaded, so, I'm gonna send out a little drone, buddy. To verify that everything else is clear. For the moment, anyway. Um, okay, there's one right there behind that mattress. Um, but the direct hallway looks pretty clear. I do know that both breathers are down because I've killed them. Um,. There's a lot of C4 in there. So from what I can tell, there is only one enemy in here. Yep. Okay. So I feel pretty confident making entry uh, with that knowledge. I could breach through there, but I don't think I'm going to. Instead, I will... Take the direct route of shooting him in the head. Oh, there's C4 in here. There is C4 in there, and my mouse button... Yeah, my scroll wheel is very, very picky. So... Oh my gosh. Okay, so that one's seven meters away, which... Means it's probably below me. Oh, somebody's making entry! Woo! Oh, there's that little devil. Oh, man. You want to talk about getting the adrenaline going. This game can definitely do it. Okay, let us continue on because as I did discover, this section was clear uh, at least, you know, a minute ago or so. Uh, um, so let's... Um, 
we're gonna have to do a little uh, point farming here, I do believe. There is a dangerous amount of C4 in the area. Oh, goodness. I wonder if I can breach this wall. No. Nope. Okay, cannot breach the wall. So that is something to keep in mind. Can I shoot? Nope. Oh, there is so much C4, and I have to go through there. I don't really think there's another... Well, I can probably go down, like breach right there, but I trust that even less than I trust dealing with the C4. So... Oh, it's all right there. Can I break this barrier, please? Thank you. Oh, but there is still some that I... that I'm not going to be able to get. I have to go through there in order to get some of it. That's going to blow if I get any closer. Okay. I think I have no other choice. That was incredibly stupid, <laughs> but I had no other choice. I hear footsteps. I hear footsteps. I heard footsteps. They were very close to me. Okay, the room behind me is clear. There is a ladder up there. Oh, uh, this is the area that I always die because I forget the basics of clearing my corners. But it looks like there's nobody in that section. There's usually somebody hiding out in there, which would appear uh, that there is not. So, the midsection is clear. Can I see anything down there? Not really, and I'm not willing uh, to go through there yet. Let's check out this side. Surprisingly, nobody hiding out. So, the rest of the seven enemies are downstairs. And, again, surprisingly, there is no C4 right here. Huh. Okay. All right, we are going straight in. Because I know for, I, well, I mean, I can guess that there's nobody up there because I should have already cleared them all out. I think I've already cleared out everybody in this midsection. So the only option left is that they are all downstairs. There's a guy right there that's going to get a headshot. Okay, that part is clear. Um, okay, drone buddy, you're up again. Uh, surprisingly, nobody there. Nobody there. Nobody there. I'm pretty sure there are people back there, but this section is clear. So is this little mid-room. Oh wait, no it's not. There's one guy right there hiding out in the corner. So I assume the rest of them are back here. I'm also going to have to scan that for, uh, for C4 when I get back there. So, we're back in business. Let's go. We have six enemies remaining. 
when uh, typically when you get to three enemies, the rest of them start rushing you. So, yeah, we have C4 right there and up above us. I'm not too worried about once up above. Let's see if I can flush him out here. I doubt it. <laughs> but he is trying to shoot me. Or is that somebody down there? That might be somebody down there. But I Oh, yep, 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 yep. Come on, poke your head out. Be a brave little boy. Be a brave little boy, come on. Damn, I still didn't kill him. He's wounded, but not dead. Ha! <laughs> oh, that's so cute. There we go, I got him. Oh, we got another. We have got another. This guy over here is getting brave. I can hear him starting to move around. There we go. All right, four enemies remaining. So what I am going to do now is kill that guy, knock that down, and wait for the rush so I can take these guys out from right here. He walked past me. Here he comes. There we go! And I have one successful mission. There is always at least one successful mission in these episodes, and I think that is it. So, I have a lone wolf success. I think IQ is my lucky girl. But, uh,. But that is going to do it for this episode, guys. I really hope you enjoyed because I love doing these. I absolutely love it. Um, but feel free to let me know what you think down in the comments below. If you love these, if you hate these, you know, whatever. If your feelings are somewhere in between, I would love to know. But that is going to do it for this episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And I will see you in the next one. Take care.